If you use VS Code's outline view, you can easily change the sort order of the symbols that are displayed in it. Now by default, VS Code will sort the outline view based on the position of each symbol in a file. So here in this TypeScript file, for example, you can see that the first symbol that's occurring in the code is this function here. And if we look over at the outline view, the first entry is also that same function. So it is sorting the outline view to match the position of each symbol in the file. Now, if we wanted to, we could go and change the outline sort order to instead sort by the symbol name, so alphabetically based on the symbol name, or we could actually have it sort based on the symbol type, so grouping things like classes and properties together. To change the sort order of the outline, all we have to do is go to the outline view itself, go over to the header, and then go to the dot 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 on the header here, and now we can change the sort order. Again, the default is to sort by position, but if we wanted it to be sorted based on the symbol name, so alphabetically based on the symbol name, we can say sort by name here. Now you can see that the first entry in the list is now allow undefined, followed by breakpoint. Now keep in mind that when you change the sort order, it is not going to flatten out the list, so it is keeping the same hierarchical structure of the outline view. So what it has done in this case, it has sorted all of the top level entries in the file alphabetically. And then for a class like breakpoint here, it has sorted all of its children alphabetically as well. So it has sorted everything alphabetically, but has not flattened out the list. It still has the same hierarchical structure. Now, if we wanted to have it instead sort based on the type of the symbol, such as class or function, we could go and again, go to the dot, dot, dot here and have it say sort by category. So this is going to sort based on the symbol type. Now, when I had done this, you can see that the first entry here is a namespace. And then as we scroll through the file, you can see that it's grouped together all of the classes. So breakpoint and um, these other classes have now all been grouped together. And again, if we look at the children of one of these classes here, you can see that it's grouped together all of the properties and the uh, methods here. So it has grouped all of the similar types of symbols together. And then within those groups, it is sorting based on name again. So it is sorting alphabetically within each of those groups. This might be a useful one if you're trying to uh, identify the types of various symbols in the file and you want to be able to quickly scroll through the list and view the outline that way. So that's a quick look at the sorting options for VS Code's outline view.